County family needs help to bury their teenage son who was killed in a suspected drunk driving crash. That collision happened in San Antonio, Texas. 18-year-old Miguel Hernandez died. Other relatives are in area hospitals. Channel 2's Carl Willis is live in Cobb County. And Carl Hernandez, you found out today, was a senior at South Cobb High School. Yeah, he was a senior here. This is just one of the places where he shared his love for life, a life that was taken so suddenly. The Hernandez family had a holiday filled with love, celebrating with relatives in Mexico. But a wrong way driver up into their plans to return home safe and sound. Um, there's so much anger at the same time uh, for, you know, the person that came and hit us. Myra Hernandez was in that crash on I-35 in San Antonio Saturday. She and her two-year-old son suffered cuts and burns from the crash. Her mother and cousin were thrown from the van, causing broken bones. But her little brother, 18-year-old Miguel Hernandez, suffered from a fatal head injury. Everything was good, you know, seconds before. Police say a suspected drunk driver was going the wrong way on the interstate and hit a truck and then veered into the Hernandez's van, causing the destruction that you see here in an instant. It was completely just demolished everything. Miguel had muscular dystrophy, but family members say the senior at South Cobb High School never let his condition define him. Rather, it was his heart filled with faith in God and love for others. And you would look at him and you wouldn't see the condition he had. We were there and the family returned to their Powder Springs home Monday without the young man, who they describe as friendly and silly without a mean bone in his body. The family has started a GoFundMe account to help pay for his funeral. You just gotta hug your loved ones as much as you can and tell them how much you love them. Now we've posted the family's GoFundMe account on Twitter and inside of the story on WSBTV.com. Reporting live in Cobb County, Carl Willis, Channel 2, Action News, Nightbeat.